Hi, my name is Dave Hart. I'm a commander in the Coast Guard and chief of the Coast Guard's Performance Technology Center located in Yorktown, Virginia. And my first exposure to human performance technology or performance improvement was uh, as an instructor at the Coast Guard's Officer Candidate School in Yorktown, Virginia, where we trained 50% of the, of the Coast Guard's frontline managers uh, who grow to be the senior leadership of the organization. Uh, and that was really through the training piece. Um, but that gave me enough to, to say that there was something to this performance improvement thing and then decided to go to graduate school uh, in, in the field and where I was fortunate enough to study with uh, Dr. Allison Rossett and where she focused on analysis. So one of my biggest influences was uh, Allison's book, First Things Fast, which really talked about you know, how do you do this thing, uh, how do you improve performance in a way that doesn't bog you down in the weeds uh, so Alice's, Allison's thing was about, you know, co go collect the information you need to solve a problem, uh, but just get the information you need so you can make a sound business decision and move on. Not every time you're trying to solve a problem is it, a, is it an academic piece of work that has to be statistically significant. You know, if we can just get the information we need to make a business decision, we're much more effective and efficient with our organization's resources. Uh, a project I've been involved in recently, well, as chief of the Performance Technology Center, that's really what we do. We try to solve Coast Guard problems as they relate to individuals and teams and units uh, to increase the Coast Guard's performance and what we would call operational readiness. Uh, one of the projects we're currently working on is uh, we've had a rash of small boat incidents or mishaps, as we would say, uh, and some of those related to helicopters. Uh, we've actually lost some helicopters and we've lost some crew on those helicopters. So we're looking at the interface between uh, how Co Coast Guard helicopters and boats interface to do search and rescue missions to try to make those safer, not only in the training mission. We can make the training mission very safe. The problem is then it doesn't correlate to the real world environment where they have to deal with weather and uh, vision, you know, night vision uh, and hazards that would be unforeseen. So we're trying to look at that process and see where we can find some root causes and make it safer overall. And we apply human performance technology to do that. And that's one of the great things about HPT is that we can apply it to almost anything. I've applied it to uh, the example I just gave. We've applied it to people trailering boats. Uh, we've applied it to, if you can come up with something in the Coast Guard, we've probably applied HPT to it. Uh, my 30 second elevator speech, when people ask me what I do, you know, Chief of the Performance Technology Center is kind of a mouthful. I really tell them we're an internal management consulting business that looks at Coast Guard issues to make the Coast Guard a more efficient and effective place for the taxpayer. Uh, we sort of pride ourselves in saying that we are solvers of ill-defined problems. Uh, and that's actually something I got from Judy Hale, so I can't take credit for that. But uh, So what we do is, you know, often people come to us and say, I have a problem here. And they may be correct that that's where the actual problem lies, but often we have to peel back the layers of the onion to find out where the actual pain is. Uh, and uh, we have a set process to do that, and, and it allows us to make sure that things are standardized and uh, repeatable. So, uh, my current and future, future focus is I'm uh, soon to be transitioning out of the Coast Guard after a successful 20 year career, extremely passionate about this thing we call performance improvement and uh, hoping to do this for somebody on the outside as well uh, to make their organization better and more effective and efficient. Thank you.